There's a lot of discussion as to whether or not the law, the federal law, is going to be able to go after Hillary Clinton and finally prove that what she did with her emails and what she did with emails that were not supposed to be put on telephones or other people's email accounts, but were supposed to be protected under emails that are controlled so that no one else sees them. She should be locked up and put in jail. She has done things. She has taken emails and allowed other people to see them. She has allowed other people to get into an email account and see things they should have never been able to see. And so what we need to know, understand with Hillary Clinton is she's lied about that and she continues to lie about it. Will she be put away? I have no idea. Do I hope so? I certainly do. Well, it is a fact that we've had some who work for the government, including the Pentagon, who have done the same thing Hillary Clinton already has been found to have done. And these individuals have been sentenced to prison. And so I would say to the government, treat Hillary Clinton no more special than you treated those other individuals who have been found guilty of the same thing that Hillary has and no charges have been brought against her. The gentleman, yes. the gentleman who set up the home server, who set up the system in her home, it's strange that they have given him immunity for his testimony. You would not give someone immunity in the government unless you believe a crime has been committed. Well, I agree. And I don't think they should prolong it. If they're going to come after her, deal with it now well, why so they won't say we waited to the very end to why indict we put her. her husband deal in with jail. it now. Why don't we put her husband in jail for lying to the American people, saying that he didn't have sex with that young lady in his office? I mean, what we've seen is that in many times, the federal government doesn't come after people they should. We all know what happened to her husband. Do we think it's going to happen to Hillary? But, I certainly hope so. But, Matt, if we were to lock up politicians for lying about who they've had sex with, we would not have enough politicians in the Senate or Congress to cast a vote. So let's not throw stones when they're all living in a glass house. Because, remember, you've had just as many Republicans to have been caught in illicit affairs with women just like we're not, Democrats. We're not talking so about we don't want to go there. We're not talking about sex. We're talking about lying to the American people. I don't care what the topic Matt, is. One thing, we don't lie. Hillary Matt, is lying. One thing about a lie, it don't care who tell it. And what politician is not running around America lying to the American people? That's why the Republicans are having an internal Cruz. civil war right now because they've been lying to their own voters. Ted Cruz isn't lying to the American people. Look, I think we agree on a lot of this topic. I'm, I'm right there with you. Let's take Hillary and put her behind bars if that's what happens in a court. And Ted Cruz is called lying Ted by Donald, right? He hasn't lied.